Hello Confetti Club, it is Pixie, and today is a shoe unboxing day. The best kind of day. I've been waiting for these shoes in the mail, they are from YRU, and YRU probably is my favorite shoe brand. I have three pairs by them now, and I love them all dearly. Um, they came out with this design. Um, probably a couple months ago, and when I saw it, I fell in love, I freaked out, and you will see why in a moment, because it is made for me, but I'm not made of money, and they're expensive shoes, and especially with the Canadian exchange rate, I don't always have the ability to drop like $230 after shipping and conversion on shoes. How skis, they were having a 40% off sale. Friend for back to school. Friend. And I think they might still be having it. Friend. So, if you want some why are you shoes, this is not spawns, obviously. I may or may not have had a cheeky peeky, uh, because I could not wait and I needed to nap, but I will show you guys now. So, do 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 do. Uh, my address is on here in three places and I can't cover it up, but it comes in a big bag. I'll just put Cure Marine on it. Ooh. Um, so it comes in a big bag like this, with the box in it. That might be open, because I might have peed. The box is nothing too, too exciting. Um, I've had Why Are You boxes before that were more, like, flashy. This one is just white, and, like, beat up, with the logo on it kind of metallic, but that's fine. Because it's what's inside that counts. I'm sorry, sometimes I look like this, and then I look like Wade from freaking Kim Possible. Did he have glasses? where his eyes didn't show. I feel like he did. Sometimes I do this, and I look like Codename Kids Next Door, <laughs> and sometimes you can see my face. I'm sorry about that. So the shoes I got are the da 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 Oh, you still can't see it. They are the, <laughs> this is drawn out, air confetti. A good confetti motif. You guys know that. And when I saw that they were coming out with their air sneakers in a confetti pattern, I lost my just a little bit. And I was like, man, they look kind of like yellowy and you can see they're not like a perfect white. Um, but I think I'm going to replace these laces with like a pink satin ribbon and I think that's gonna be super cute. So we have like the Y shape that they have in all, almost all of their sneakers. And then the best part is that the confetti glitter spangle flakes are all different shapes and sizes. So we got stars, we got circles, we got flowers, we got butterflies. I think that's it. Oh, we got octagons. Oh, what a treat. Oh, and it's also shiny. Um, I thought it was gonna be more like a canvas material from seeing online, but I was wrong. And then, are you ready for the joy that is? Oh, sh Oh, sh Light up. This is my first pair of light up shoes. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love them. I hope they're comfy because they're like, um, they're like a pleather inside, and I feel like that would be kind of like hot and sticky. Um, I feel like it wouldn't really let your foot breathe, but. We'll check. I also hope I can just slip these on and off because I'm super lazy and there is no way I'm gonna be like untying and retying the laces literally ever. My cat just jumped in the laundry hamper. What are you doing? So I got these in a size eight because I'm a size eight. And I really hope they fit because when I got the YRU night call heels when I did the Zuji collaboration, they were way too small. Small, small, they were small, they didn't fit. I think they were small um and people were saying that their heels run small and their like flat shoes run big 
um, but I have other flat shoes by them and they fit me really well so I'm hoping this will be okay if not I mean it has laces at least so there's a little bit of wiggle room Ooh, I'll give you guys some more close -ups. okay no there is a little like breathy perforated thing on the inside so your feet won't just be like sweaty town so they have these sheer i think like organza ribbons which are cute but i think i'm gonna try it with a pink sort of design to bring some pink in maybe like a hotish pink just nothing like too too pastel then on the backs they have these little aliens which is not really my aesthetic but i mean it's so small i didn't notice this online doesn't make me like it any less. It's not that important. Here's the bottom if you needed to see that. Fresh never been walked on the ground before. Um, I don't know if you ever have to replace the batteries in these things. Is that what this is for? There's like a sneaky little mystery compartment. Maybe that's just the way the soul goes. Um, but I'd imagine they wouldn't just go forever. I don't think there's any way to access it from the inside. I'm sure that's on the site somewhere. I'm sure that information exists in the world, but holy frig, you guys. I am so hype about this. All right, I'm gonna try these on. I'm gonna go for a little walkabout. We're gonna see them in all their flashy, flashy glory. It's almost sunset here, so the lighting is good-ish for it. You should be able to actually see the lights lighting up. These shoes definitely are the right size for me, but I think it's the kind of shoe that's gonna need a heavy bit of breaking in. Um, they are, I guess, do you call these high tops? They're pretty high up on your ankle, and I find that it's very stiff and is a little bit rubby and uncomfortable, um, but it does come with those handy dandy sort of metal hooks on the top so you don't have to straight up lace them through you just can kind of weave them around so that's handy um and they don't flash lights when you're just regularly walking you kind of have to jump or like step or stomp your foot which i mean is probably a good thing so you're not flashing at inappropriate times but i do really like these shoes i hope that with a little bit of breaking in the tops will be more comfy um i think i just need to make sure i wear these with socks like the ones i have on where they go above the shoe so it doesn't like rub the crap out of my ankle because blood on white shoes would not be good. Here's some cats. Oh, I'm so sorry. I thought we could do this together, but maybe not. Hey, are you comfy? Are you comfy? <laughs> You seem pretty comfy. It's his birthday today. He's five years old. Everyone comment, happy birthday, Nico. Happy birthday, Nico. And then there's that one. He's really good. And there's that one. He's pretty good. We just finished modding our deck to be a catio instead of a patio. So now, oh, is he gonna do it? Is he gonna do it? Go get him, baby. Yay! <laughs> this video's Future Confetti Club member is Lady J872. Here she is looking super freaking fly. This is the first picture I have seen of someone in one of my new designs in my spreadsheet shop. The Funfetti sweater. You're looking freaking cute. Look at that PK cord. You got this, oh my gosh, your earrings are sparkly. Those are amazing. What a look, love you so much. Again, as a refresher, since this is kind of like re-coming back after being gone for a while, if you guys would like to be a Feature Confetti Club member, please post a pic of yourself on Instagram with you in one of your items from my spreadshirt with the hashtag Feature Confetti Club member and please tag me too. Um, tag me in the actual picture so that I'm sure to see it and you will be featured and it will be delicioso. All right, punks, I love you so, so much and I'll see you in the next video, which is not this one because this one is over. Goodbye. Also, Frig, dude, welcome to the background family. Rainbow bright and tickled pink, dude, Hallmark, came out with these new ginormous rainbow bright dolls they're like they're humongous like she's a thick boy and they are so freaking sweet 
and I just had to go and get them. So if anyone's gonna be like, hey, where are your Rainbow Bright dolls from? Hallmark, you can get them online, not spawns, just rainbow.